Hey everyone, welcome back to Cuddy's Bookshelf. So today is July's Fairy Loot. It's my second ever Fairy Loot, so I'm very, very excited. So as always, I have cut the tea and let's just get into it. Oh my goodness. Okay, your sneak peek's not very good on. Here's your... Sneaky peeky. Alright, so as always, I'll just pull a monster family crest coaster set designed by Blue Lee Boo. This is the little box it comes in. Very cute design. Oh, I like them. Oh, are they all the same? Oh, no, they're not. So, the coasters look like this. So this is the first one. The second one. The third one. And the fourth one. They are so nice. I really like them. They've got um, cork bottom on each of them. So good for non-slipping. I really like that they're um, like matte as well. Like there's no layer to them or anything I really like that Ooh. I think oh I like all of them I probably say I like the fox the best because I just love foxes they're so cute right put them back in the box first thing down really like it um right next is oh Cruel Intentions Magnetic Bookmarks by Noon De Noonie Designs. The packaging. Oh, they're nice. So they are different swords, daggers. I like those. I don't think I actually own any magnetic bookmarks. I'm a thinner the better type person, but I do like a bit of a tassel on my bookmark. So these will be interesting to use. Next one is the Nightmare Pin, designed by No One Designs. The Nightmare. And this is your... Let me, and this is the pin. Very nice, very nice. Another one to go on my banner. Does everyone still love receiving pins? Because I, I love getting pins in like any of my boxes. So I get um, a Lumicrate, Fairy Loot, and I have a Witch Casket one where I always get a pin in that. And I love them. Right. Oh, we have socks. I've heard a lot about um, Fairy Loot socks, that they're supposed to be really comfy. And they're the Wicker King socks, designed by Jazz Hawk. Let's take them. Oh, yeah. And I do actually own Wicker King. But I haven't actually read it yet. So I can wear my socks while I read it. <laughs> Cozy. I'm loving everything in this so far. Really am. And then you get this big box and it says Collection of the Magical Tomes Volume 2. Designed by Chatty Nora. Book of Not a clue. Collection of Magical Tomes Volume 2. Oh, the book of fate so is it like a it is oh i like that so it's like a storage so this is the inside and then this bit's obviously just where you put your bits in and then it looks like this on the front and then down the sides 
and the back. I love how it really does have like the pages. I really like this. I think I can use this for no um, my tabs and that lot for when I'm annotating because I did go to put it in a metal thing but my husband didn't like them in there. So I could put them in this now and put it on my shelf. So yeah, I'll get lots of use out of that. I'm guessing with it saying volume two, like people that's had fairy loots had one of these in there before. So oh, this is so fun. And I think the last thing is the book. Is there anything in the bottom? Well, we'll, we'll do the book first because I think that's the order they want you to do it in. Again, I love that Fairy Loot still come in this straw drawstring bag. Hating the bubble wrap on Illumicrates. That's my one gripe I used to really enjoy. Here we go. It's upside down. <laughs> oh, we've got loads of bits in here as well. So we have... A bookmark and then it just again says July 2023 cruel intentions box and then we have this really nice artwork with a letter from the author which I really do like a note from the author it's very personalized and then the book is The Threads That Bind. Yeah, this is gorgeous. I love the coloration of this book. And then we have a reversed, a reverse cover. So you can have it this way if you want. It's very thin though. Know how no because it's all matte. It's it's very thin. I'll be scared of ripping that. And the end pages look like this. That's the front. Is the back different? The back is different. This is the back. But then on the naked hardback itself, there's this gorgeous foiling. And then there is like stars in the sky on the top and bottom and then so it goes around like that. So very like celestial themed. Very, very nice. It is signed. Can you even see that? It is signed by the author and one of the praises for the book say is dripping with atmosphere and edge with danger threads that bind weaves together a gorgeous dark tapestry of mystery fated romance and modern myth you won't be able to put this one down and that is by Alexandra Bracken who wrote Law just there so and it says the firstborn was the spinner who could weave new threads. The second was a drawer who could elongate or shorten a thread, intensifying or awakening the corresponding feeling. And the youngest was the cutter, able to cut whatever thread she desired, even life threads. Cutters were the dangerous ones. Mm. It's such a gorgeous book though. Shall we see it on the reverse way? And if you reversed it, this is what it would look like. I like that it's like floppy. Nothing worse when you get a hardback and like it's it goes up like this when you're trying to read it. So you like turn a page, but then you're like constantly battling with the page to hold it down. This is satisfying. It's the little things. It's the little things. Fairy Scoop, which is a interview with the author. So I love that you get these. I haven't seen that in many boxes before. Um, then there's the spoiler card with this gorgeous artwork on it. 
and then you get your two tarot cards so one is knight of stars very gorgeous art and then the other one is page of stars very very pretty and that is everything let me have a look at so the coasters was inspired by Vanessa Lenz captivating novel only a monster I think I have that but I haven't read it yet I could also be lying Aha, I do I do have it I knew I did so this is inspired by only a monster secret book by chatting or I discovered the enchanting book of fate second volume of our secret book collection of ma uh, magical tombs safeguard your fairy loot collectible tarot within its pages see what I've done with my tarot is so obviously these are the last two that I got in the last box and in one of my um, witch caskets I got this little easel is it, is it called to prop things up on so I've had these ones since I opened the last one I've had these ones sat on it on my shelves so what I'm going to do is just put these ones over the top so that's not, that's where I'm going to put those and like I said before with this book um, I'm going to put my bits for annotating in it so the pin is inspired by one dark window it says this enamel pin beautifully captures the nightmare one of the providence cards of one of the providence cards so that's that obviously the socks are from the wicker king i said that i think they go really well with the book the wicker king by k ankrum this is um going to be paired together when i read it <laughs> apparently it's supposed to be really really good and, I'll, and then the pages are supposed to represent like someone's mental health getting worse or something along them lines. It's been a while since I hauled this, but I still haven't read it. But now I've got some cozy socks to wear when I do read it. And then uh, magnetic bookmark. Lorenz takes an elegant shade of pink with these cool intentions, mag magnetic bookmarks. Indulge in their beauty. Add a touch of glamour to your reading experience. So they're just... cruel intentions the bookmarks are just from the theme of the month but i do really really like those so yeah so the two tarot cards you have nathaniel as the page of stars card and elizabeth as the knight of stars and the characters are from sorcery of thorns and it says the book of the month is a fantasy uh, where a descendant of the Greek fates must solve a series of impossible murders to save her sisters, her soulmate and her city. Your very exclusive edition has an exclusive cover, a reversible dust jacket by Blanca Designs, designed to sprayed edges on all three edges, foil on the hardcover and artwork on the end papers. And is signed by the author. Don't forget to read the author letter and check out the character print on the reverse side. The next month is Reap What You Sow, so we can look forward to that together. What's my favourite? I'm probably going to say the book because this is going to be really useful, so I'll probably say the book is my favourite because I have been needing somewhere to put a um, annotating supply so this is going to come in extremely handy for me so this is my favourite of the month um, I am really looking forward to the book again I think it's absolutely gorgeous so this excites me loads and yeah that is everything for July's fairy loot I hope that you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up if you would like to see more from me please subscribe and I hope to see you in my next video Bye.
so I'm very excited as always. <laughs> I need to calm down, I need to calm down. <laughs> I need to calm down. Every single time. Uh, battle of the pooch. Come and look at mummy's new coasters. Cool intentions, mag magnetic. Designed by no one did I. By the way, my nails aren't dirty. Um, I my brow pencil broke and I couldn't get it out of my nail. I need to scrub them. So I cut my nails. And I cut them down too far. No, when you have that like skin under your nails. Um, I cut the hard bit of my nail and it had skin thingy and then like it's gone in between the two. But yeah. Anyway. Enough about my hygiene. Oh my goodness. I think I have more trouble with dust jackets. Being slippery little buggers. Waving around everywhere. In one of my. Hold on. <laughs> I'll stop you from wobbling. So that's what I'm going to use. That's not what I'm going to use that tub for, should I say? Oh, bloody Norway. So that is. Yeah. Where did I put the bloody pen now? That. The two tarot cards you have um, Nathaniel as the page of star uh, as the page of stars card, hmm. and Elizabeth as the king as the knight of stars. Ah, my annotation, annotation, annotating. If you'd like to see more from blah, 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 blah. it says. Next month's theme is reap what you sow. So, so, <laughs> yeah, so, 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 so. Last month's, this month's. Mm. We need a new binder soon.